evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another episode of the non Cooperators. We're back playing some more Metal Gear. Metal Gear Ghost Battle, that's it. Okay. So, right where the last left off, uh, we're trying to find Dr. James um, Harks, the engineer who designed... Uh, is it froze? Oh, there it goes. I was going to say, did it froze? To find the new design Metal Gear is being held somewhere in that building. Rescue him and get as much inf information about Metal Gear out, uh, out of him as possible. So... Just like in Metal Gear Solid, uh, that's going to be our Otacon. Okay. Seriously, this feels very loud for me. I don't know why. Maybe it's like right up in my friggin' ear or something. I don't know how loud it is for you guys. Let me uh, try lowering it just a wee, wee bit. Okay. Is that good? Or it sounds the same, honestly. Alright, I think that might be a little bit better, but I probably need to speak up just a wee bit! Alright, um, here's where I'm gonna have to actually utilize the, uh, the box trick, um, a little bit in this, in this, uh, section. The conveyor belts actually are gonna have, like, um... <sighs> Damn it. Can't open it. The conveyor belts are gonna be having these, uh... You have to go, uh, these, uh, options were, or, the, no, these gateways that... Gateways. They're gonna have to. Um, they're gonna have to go through. But it scans the box, so you're gonna have to like use um, certain color boxes in order to go through these gateways. I think that's where you end up if you fuck up. Okay, this is. Hang on, let me see what I can do. Hang on, items. Nope. This is gonna be this is gonna be interesting. Uh, the box. Nope. Okay. Well, this sucks. Maybe I gotta go through the elevator. Punch! 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 Uh, here's here's where it gets a little bit fucked up because now I actually have a bottom level and a top level. It's got like super multiple floors. But let's go to the uh, let, let's start from the bottom, work our way to the top. I seriously doubt that's even gonna work at all in the first place. But let, let's just see. Damn it, I, my fucking green screen is just being a bitch. Hang on. I think it moves automatically. Honestly, up oh, there it goes. It's tilting. It is tilting. Yeah, but this side is all dark. So let me uh put the light on. Oh, you know my M.O. Nothing is ever prepared whenever I start doing recording sessions. Alright. So now we're down in the basement. Hello! It's me, the snake! Should I even bother doing my snake, my snake impersonation anymore? Because honestly, the last couple of episodes I was noticing, holy shit, I was really half-assing it. So it was really not good at all whatsoever, so... You know what it really is? I'm, I'm only good when I do it nice and low and I do a nice tone of it. Not when I'm like, I gotta scream it out or, or, or half-ass it or do it fast or anything like that. When I take my time with it and I'm like up right up to the, to the mic like that, then I, can, then I can do it pretty good. Or I can do it just okay. I'm not gonna surpass the old great David Hayter. I think it was kind of a waste to kill that dude just like that. I, I mean, a waste of shots. Unless if if, if we ever get a friggin' uh, more ammunition, please. Dun dun dun! I wait. That's another uh, spot where the conveyor belt ends up. This fucking green screen, serious? Well, it's not the green screen actually. It's actually the light that's making everything all fucked up. Yeah, see if I go close to it, like anything that's like too super bright, it just goes it goes chroma keyed. And he's alive, that son of a bit. Wait, is he alive or is that someone else? No, he he that's him. He's he is alive. I think on the radar. So like I said, it definitely was a waste of a shot. Damn it! You know what? Ah. Let me go 
back to my weapons. This one. I think the only time you can actually do that is you could sneak on it just like this, but there's really no point. Oh, what? Now he, he respawned? Oh, fuck that. I'm not going. I'm not going. The little ding, ding, ding you're hearing, that's uh, me stepping up. Why is there so many grenades in this freaking level? I'm guessing I'm going to have to use... That's something I'm going to definitely have to utilize. Oh, shit. I shouldn't have done that. No, nope, worked into my favor. Drop something I need. Drop something that I need. Bastard. Little choppy. Holy crap. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Maybe I gotta go up the stairs. Uh, all the way up to the second floor or some shit like that. How do I get to that room? Tap dance, tap dance, tap 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 tap. Run 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 run. Boom, 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 boom. Um, yeah, okay. All right, so we just go to the second floor then. Punch, 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 punch. Yeah, I'll I'll try to do my snake impersonation again, but I gotta move this mic a little bit closer to my to my to my face. So hang on, let me uh. The problem is the mic is gonna be like right up. It's, it's gonna block everything. So let me try fixing that then. So it's not gonna be as professional as it actually, as I usually am. Yeah, that's the, that's the best I can do is just putting it right here. Which, take, in all honesty, I really should keep the mic right here, but it's like it's in the it's in the way. And I try to like you know for your viewing pleasure, I try to make this all as professional as possible. Look, I'm not a professional let's player. I'm just here just having uh, having some fun. If I get, again, you know, I, I appreciate all your support and everything, and I, d I definitely do enjoy it. I love it. If you guys really wanted me to do the snake impersonation, I'll see if I could have an opportunity of doing it. All right, here's the conveyor belts where I'm going to have to start doing this. All right, so I'm going to start using my box. Yellow box is the only one that I actually have. But now that you see right here, it only registers as a yellow box. So I'm just going to have to sneak my way through this facility using my yellow box so right there I think we need to oh, hang on I'm sorry <clears throat> you see right there that's where I need to use my red box but actually it's all trial and error and honestly it's a bitch this trial and error type of uh, type of uh, uh, area oh, yeah I, I, <laughs> conveyor belt's too strong see like I don't know if I would have to use the yellow box I mean, the red box right then and there See, I remember doing this part, and it's a bitch. Or it's just very tedious. And very annoying, honestly. Ugh. There's definitely an order to it, but I don't know what the hell it is. Alright, see, now we're in here, which gives us the red cardboard box. I find it kind of funny. It's like... All right, so we're back up here. Knock, knock. I'm just gonna punch the shit out of you. <laughs> I don't know, I can't do uh, his impersonation when he does like the grunting noises. He doesn't even have any grunting noises. I think he just does that in the third one. Or the no, the third and fourth one is when he does his uh, his fighting style. Oh crap! Doesn't really have a fighting style. It's just all CQC. Even in the fourth one, that's when he started doing a CQC. Why didn't he do it in the other ones? Because well, there was a reason actually why he didn't do CQC in one uh, in one and two. Um, I'm trying to remember exactly what it was, but it was like saying because he did it, uh, he learned it from his father, and he was like saying, oh, I don't want to. Do use this anymore because it's like you know something that my father did and my trying to like to not follow what my father did, but he had to start doing it again because all the soldiers were like upping their games. So I'm like fuck it now I got to do what my father did. <laughs> yeah, this light is just terrible. It's not helping. Well, it's helping the screen but not helping me. I just fucking me up. I just have to keep constantly moving it and moving it and moving. It. Now here's where it's gonna get super shit, super tedious and. 
WTF wise. So let's use the red box for now. You gotta be careful though, because if there is sentries and enemies around here, they will be like, "Oh, a box is moving." So that did nothing at all whatsoever. <laughs> Son of a bitch. All right. Um, items. There. Yellow. And I think you can't change it when they're looking. I think. I could be wrong, though. Oh, shit. I think the alarm goes off. I mean, I don't want to find out, though. It's very annoying trying to switch boxes back and forth. I'll probably fuck that up, honestly. Do, 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 do. Now let's go back to using the light yellow box. See where that takes us. I think it just fucked us up. Yeah, it just did. Unless we end up somewhere that we actually need to be. No. No, we're not anywhere that we want to be. Damn! Like, we're definitely nowhere where we want to be. We're on the first floor? Yeah, we're on the first floor. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Finding the doctor? It's a motherfucker. Why can't I just do what I did back in Metal Gear Solid 1? Just using the key to missile, blow up uh, the, the electric wall, the, the electric floor, and, 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 and try to run a... Uh, and, and try to run across it while the whole entire room is, is gassed up. That was so much easier than what I'm doing right now. I feel like I gotta write this the, this pattern down. Yellow, yellow. Or it could be blue. That's what I need to find. I need to find the blue box most likely. So it's gonna be like yellow, yellow. Oh, red. Okay, that's a little skippy. It's just skipping right now. Hang on. Okay. Red. I think we have to... Yeah, I uh, red this time. Again. It's the first one. Yeah, there you go. Bing! Hopefully this takes me to where I need to be. See, it's very choppy and laggy. Nope! That's the wrong spot. Shit. Alright. Well, at least we don't have to go through an elevator. Alright, just uh, yellow, yellow... It's all trial and error, guys. Trial, trial and error. Ah! Okay, so... Okay, so yellow, yellow, and then the next one's gotta be red. Wait, no, 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 no. Yellow, yellow, yellow. Now this one's red. I hope. I really hope so, guys. God damn, this thing is all chopped up to show. Oh, fuck me. No, go yellow. Because it's going to take us back to where we don't want to be. Go red. <laughs> go, go red! Hopefully this is this is good. Damn it! I was kind of praying on that one that that would have worked. <laughs> So we need to. I hopefully it's probably level three. We probably need to go back to it though. So I don't. I don't know. Go red. Uh, I don't. I don't know. I'm just. I'm just. I'm just guessing at this point. Okay, we're somewhere new-ish. There's an elevator. Not an elevator. It's a ladder right there. Room is full of poison gas. I have to use my gas mask. Damn! Someone's in here. But don't worry, I found a level 3 ID card. It's exactly what I need. So this is exactly where I want to be. Come closer so I can break your neck. Damn! Hopefully this opens up with level 3 key card. Good. Okay. Now we're uh, the beginning. Oh shit! I almost yeah, I almost ran into it. Are we in the beginning or what floor are we? Uh, first floor. Actually, now that we have level three key card, let's see what, what, what we can open up. 
This door, right? Yay! We can open up this door. Let's go down the ladder and see where it takes us. This episode might run a little bit long, and I do apologize. Chef grenades. I think we're in the basement right now. Yeah, we're in the basement. Going up the ladder. What a thrill. Darkness and silence through the night. I do that song a little bit too good, so that's a little, a little disturbing. All right, back to the second floor and doing the goddamn com. Wait, we can let's see if we can go through that door again. I think I forgot what the I forgot what the combination was. It was yellow, 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 red. I don't even know anymore. I really don't know. What I really need is I need ammunition for that f for the five seven pistol. Oh, by the way, guys. Um. Shit, I'm trying to think. I think it was posted up right now. Um. I'm sure you guys have actually seen it right now that I've actually made the uh, the Snake Match 1911 Colt Pistol. Uh, I actually might be making a couple more and trying to sell them if you guys actually really want them. It is a little bit pricey because, well, uh, in all honesty, the gun was uh, the gun itself was actually very expensive. It was like almost $500, which I was, that's the price I'm selling. Wait, wait, shit, no! I wanted to go down. Damn it. All right, well, whatever. So I wanted to go through there. I can't get off the conveyor belt. No, we went through there already. All right. Uh, the pistol, I know it's going to be expensive. I'm going to be selling it a little bit expensive. I might do a best offer so you guys can, you know, let me a price that you wanted that's comfortable for you. Maybe, maybe not. But the it's very hard to make the pistol. It's also very expensive to get it and, and everything. All right. So that's definitely. All right. So we definitely need to go through there. We definitely need the blue, uh, the blue cardboard box. We definitely need the blue cardboard box. That's a, that's a given. Um. In order to get that, though, I think it's probably in that room that we actually need to go through uh, with the key card and everything. Wait, where the fuck are we? I am so confused on exactly where we are. Now I'm, ju I'm just, like, baffled. I don't know how I was able to punch him through that, but you know what? It worked. Whatever. I'm trying to remember where the hell that ladder was, but you know what? I'm not even going to bother trying to find it. Turn the fuck around, motherfucker! Not even going to... It's not, not worth the shot. Yay. Oh, the ladder's over there. It doesn't matter since I'm already here by the elevator. Whoops. It's like my back foot is like it's like like tippy toeing and stepping, eh, steppy step step. It's like I'm doing like a like a like a jazz type of uh, dance, going. Eh, 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 eh. All right, so this episode is actually running way too long, so you know what? I'm gonna have to stop it right here. Uh, so next time on the non-cooperators, hopefully we can actually get uh, find the right path and get through it. So we'll see you next time. Where did you come from, Katnado?